it annoys me. Hey. Haley. What? Aren't you going to address the elephant in the room? You mean the beanie baby in the basket? No. You missed a video last week. See, the thing is, I had to work and I had to study really viciously for my SATs because they were on Saturday and also I uh, had uh, no uh, final no, this no week, excuses. so I just didn't really Here, have time things to make just... a video. No, what's... Never mind. Just apologize to the audience. I'm sure they understand and probably don't care. No, you have to apologize. And not just for last week, for the last two shitty videos that you made, because that is unacceptable. Nat from Community Channel didn't upload for a few months, and people still love her, so I think I'm excused from a month of not-so-good content. That's because she's hot and Asian. What do you have? No, sweetie. Hi guys! Yeah, I know, I missed a video last week in nine months! Wow, okay, that, let's just call it a maternity leave and move on, okay? Okay. But no, seriously, I did have my SATs and I was really worried about my algebra funnel and I had work. Don't lie to us, Haley. you made out with your boyfriend's face. One time! One time that week! But on the bright side, that's all done now! I've officially done the school for the year that officially restarts in... About 74 days. I don't have a calendar on my wrist. Now I often say that I hate school and fair enough because so does 90% of the population. That's an over exaggeration. No one fucking asked you. Well, I hate being forced to learn subjects that I care nothing about. Prime example, Algebra 2. I hate doing math. But I know, math is essential, but everything above middle school material is pretty much unnecessary for somebody who isn't going to be going into that kind of field. What I don't get is why we're being force-fed subjects, because if you're not interested in something, then I'm pretty sure that's A, they're not going to be dedicated to learning it, and B, they would probably forget it as soon as they learned it, because it's not interesting to them. Haven't studies shown that students who are more interested into their subjects are more likely to learn than those who don't? High school is merely a way to keep kids occupied until they're mature enough to go out on their own because really when you're a kid you don't have the maturity to go out and get a job and live on your own so what do you make them do in the meantime? Then learn. Only learn things that you don't want to learn. You learn what we tell you to learn. I would like to point out, however, that high school is not completely useless. Even if there are subjects you're not per necessarily interested in, it doesn't mean that they're completely useless, like English composition. There's plenty you can get out of high school, and you can learn a lot, but that doesn't excuse the fact that people are put into boxes that they don't need to be put in. Over the course of my three years in high school so far, I have learned almost nothing inside the classroom. I learned much more from YouTube and social networking sites and when I went to look up things on the internet because I was interested in learning them. And I chose to learn about these things and they stick. If you don't actually learn, there's no point. And forcing it doesn't work. That's what she said. Really? I would also like to acknowledge that everybody's high school experience is different. Maybe you learned a lot inside the class. But my point is it's selfish and unnecessary to force kids into doing things that they don't necessarily need to do. You want kids to learn? Let them learn what they want. Some kids really like math. They will take those upper level math classes. But I can almost guarantee you that the one who picked their classes will learn a lot more than those who didn't pick their classes. I do understand that there's a basic necessity of things that kids learn, but you can pretty much learn that all throughout middle school. One of the things that people say about high school is that it gives you the chance to try new things without a real risk factor. But if somebody decides to take statistics, it's not like you can drop the class if you really hate it. You have to stick with it for an entire semester or an entire year. And hey, if you don't understand it, you can't do poorly. Otherwise, you're not going to get into a good college and you're not going to get a good job. You have to succeed in things that you hate, otherwise your future is fucked. How much pressure does that put on kids, and how is that healthy? In high school, I'm like this. Take it away, clone. <laughs> <laughs> then again, this is just my opinion. Feel free to disagree. That means if you disagree, I will set you on fire. That's not what it means. Anyway, I hope you have a lovely day. Good luck on all your exams and everything, if you still have them and any kind of tests. And hopefully I will be back with a funnier video next week. Cross your fingers. Bye.